There's a continent at the edge of our world, buried under ice, miles and miles of it. A frozen desert, untouched by human hands for millions of years. Welcome to Antarctica, a place so cold, so remote that it might as well be a world apart. But here's the real mystery. Beneath this blanket of snow and ice lies something hidden, something that could rewrite what we think we know about life, history, and perhaps even our own origins. Antarctica. You'd be forgiven for thinking that this continent, so far removed from the rest of the world, is just an empty, frozen wasteland. But what if I told you that it's a place of secrets? The kind of secrets that governments, scientists, and even the military are actively trying to uncover, layer by layer. The ice here is thick, over two miles deep in some places. That's nearly 11,000 feet. Imagine the skyscrapers of New York City completely buried under ice. What could possibly lie hidden beneath this frozen shell? Strange creatures? Forgotten civilizations? Or could it be something more? As it turns out, Antarctica isn't just a sheet of ice. Beneath that icy armor, scientists have found something remarkable. Lakes. Yes, you heard that right. There are hundreds of lakes hidden under Antarctica's ice sheets, locked in isolation for millions of years. The largest of these lakes, Lake Vostok, is buried beneath 2.5 miles of ice, and it's the size of Lake Ontario. This lake hasn't seen sunlight in over 20 million years. Scientists drilled down, and what they found was baffling. Signs of life. Life, thriving in total darkness without sunlight, in conditions far colder than any other place on Earth. Microbes unlike anything we've ever seen before. This life has adapted to extreme conditions, sparking a crucial question. Could life exist in other frozen worlds, like Jupiter's moon Europa, in a similar icy environment? But here's where things get even stranger. Some scientists believe that these ancient lakes could contain more than just microbial life. What if there were larger creatures down there? Ancient species adapted to a life under ice, cut off from the rest of the world for millennia? Think about the implications of that. And then, there's the mystery of the ancient maps. In 1513, Ottoman cartographer Piri Reis created a map that shocked scholars. It showed a continent at the southern end of the world that closely resembles Antarctica, and not just as it is today, under ice, but as it may have looked thousands of years ago, without ice. But how could an ancient map depict a continent discovered centuries later? Some speculate that ancient civilizations might have mapped this area when it was ice-free. If true, this would mean that human history is far older and far more complex than we've been taught. What if Antarctica hides the remnants of a lost civilization? Could it be that the ice sheets are concealing ruins, structures, or even entire cities? Imagine the impact of such a discovery, a forgotten chapter of humanity buried in ice. The mystery deepens with strange magnetic readings detected in Antarctica's east. These magnetic anomalies don't line up with anything we'd expect, and they're massive, hundreds of miles across. One of these anomalies near Lake Vostok could indicate the presence of an enormous metallic object. But what kind of object? Some speculate it's a natural formation, like a unique mineral deposit. But others suggest something far more controversial. An ancient artifact, a relic of a lost civilization, or even an extraterrestrial craft buried beneath miles of ice. It's worth noting that Lake Vostok has been the subject of intense research from governments around the world leading some to believe that there may indeed be something extraordinary beneath the ice. Now here's where things get really strange. Parts of Antarctica are designated as no-fly zones, restricted even to scientists. Why? The official explanation is safety, but some conspiracy theorists have another idea. Could it be that certain areas are off-limits because they contain hidden secrets? Things that certain agencies or governments don't want the public to see? Ancient artifacts, remnants of civilizations, or even evidence of extraterrestrial visitors? Some even claim that scientists have been silenced or their work classified. Is it possible that our governments know something about Antarctica's mysteries that they don't want us to find out? This brings us to one of the most controversial theories of all. Could Antarctica be hiding something not of this world? For decades, whispers of extraterrestrial connections to Antarctica have persisted. Some theorists propose that ancient visitors might have left behind relics buried beneath the ice. Others suggest that alien technology, relics from beings who walked this earth eons before us, could be hidden in those vast, cold expanses. It sounds like science fiction, right? But ask yourself, 
Why are countries willing to invest billions into such a remote, desolate place? Why are research projects shrouded in secrecy? What could possibly be worth that level of commitment? Despite the mysteries and controversies, scientific exploration in Antarctica continues. And every year we inch closer to uncovering its secrets. What will they find next? More evidence of life? New fossils? Or maybe something that challenges everything we know about our planet? Perhaps the real mystery isn't just what's under the ice, but what it could mean for all of us. So the next time you look at a map, think of Antarctica not as a cold, empty wasteland, but as a continent of secrets. Secrets that are slowly being revealed, one layer at a time. And remember, every inch of ice that melts brings us one step closer to uncovering the truth. The only question that remains, are we ready for what lies beneath?